You might like Disney's A Wrinkle in Time's trailer, but here's a bunch of people who hated it. Why didn't opera give people prizes in this trailer? Where's my car, you f Oh sh I mean Oprah. <laughs> Instead of going and fixing opera, you just said, oh sh I mean Oprah. <laughs> you didn't even like hit enter first and then realize you made a mistake. That's really confusing. When Tomorrowland sucks and Disney just ha have another crack at it, ha ha. I, I guess that counts as a comment on a video, so <laughs> cool. This is gonna flop like the golden compass. Lit, lit lol? What is lit lol? Everyone in Golden Compass was white. I'd have thought you'd loved it. He doesn't even have an icon. How the hell do you know he was white? His icon's brown. <laughs> <laughs> Oprah acting? Thank you, but I'll pass. So have you not seen the color purple or beloved or, you know, her winning awards for that? It's not like Shaq was in this movie. <laughs> or, you know, Gale. I'm gonna put this movie right next to Dragon Ball Evolution and The Last Airbender. It's a little early for sh** on it like that, Jesus. <laughs> oh man, that's a lot of terrible to base on, a, on just a trailer. <laughs> Holy crap. This is where Snoop goes when G reacts the maximum height of smoking too much weed. Someone down like four gravity bongs before typing this. I don't even know how you could type. Plus, if Snoop Dogg wrote this, it'd be called The Wrinkle in Tizzle. Should have been titled Oprah with Wrinkles. What's weird is that sounds like a maxi pad. Oprah, now with wrinkles and wings. You get a Razzie, you get a Razzie, everybody gets a Razzie. I just spit iced tea everywhere, LOL. <laughs> Does Ice T's wife know? Ew. <laughs> Your face? Yeah. Ew. <laughs> Man, Sphinx Onyx with the burn. And the name that sounds like you've made poor life decisions. You have like 24 hour pole burn on the inside of your thighs, don't you? The boredom is strong with this one. <laughs> it's Star Wars pun, that's funny. And it's also dumb. Ah, uh, fine. Just don't f this one up, okay? Watched it. Well, it's like my parents' advice when I meet a girl. And the exact response. Well, f It's because I keep meeting girls like Sphinx Onyx. <laughs> <laughs> Looks wank. What the f is that? <laughs> I mean, if there was a comma in there, it would make more sense because it is an action at that point. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> it started off good. Until I saw Oprah. Then it just went downhill from there. You know, my day started off great, but then I saw Oprah and she bought me shit. Did Stedman write this comment? That was good for a sec, but man, Nickelodeon kids have to sh** on it. Did they slime on it? What the hell are you? I don't, things are confusing. Oh good, another movie about a normal teen being told that he or she is special and important. Man, your childhood sucked. Oh, I feel terrible for you. It's like all you had to play with when you were a kid is like a paper bag, a pencil, and your dead sister. That's dark. The studios couldn't afford Tom Holland and Zendaya. Or, you know, they were busy. <laughs> <laughs> what couldn't Disney afford? <laughs> This looks genuinely retarded. Genuinely retarded is an amazing phrase. You know, you're retarded, but you know, you don't you don't beat around the bush with it. You're true to your retardedness, your retardidity. I love sci-fi movies, but when I see Disney or Disnep, it's like Tomorrowland was renamed next week and made by an Indian film company. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Catherine Murray has some explaining to do when Mr. Murray gets home. Honey, why is our daughter black? Because she was the best f***ing actress for the job. Stop being a dick. Don't think I can get through this sober. The trailer? Wow. <laughs> if that's the case, then you are awful at peopling. Ah, oh, shit, a two minute and 30 second commercial. Like shots. God does something bad and females save the day. Why does Disney feel the need to please SJWs? I have a feeling this response is going to be fun. It's a book, you fool! <laughs> <laughs> Curses! 
That's a sweet old timey burn right there. The only way that could have gotten better is right after you said it, you just went like this. <laughs> Just want a bit of a game of fisticuffs, do you? Oprah as lemony shit pants. <laughs> <sighs> lemony shit pants and a series of unfortunate diarrhea. That's a good suggestion. Neil Patrick Harris is a replacement for Oprah. Up next on O, now called N. You're getting an incredibly entertaining song and dance number. You're getting an entertaining. <laughs> 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 Looks like a fun movie to watch on Netflix. Wah, wah. I won't give you my money directly. Starring Chris Pine as Gary Johnston from Team America. That's fantastic. <laughs> That's so good. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, a film full of ugly people. That's what they call diversity. I'm leaving. A wrinkle in. Shut the f up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're exactly that person that after two vodka shots yell at your ex in the back of a club and your ex isn't there. Thanks so much for watching us make fun of the haters of A Wrinkle in Time's new trailer. If it's your first time here, hit the subscribe button, hit the little notification bell right next to it. You can click on one of the videos on the screen to see another one from us. And until we see you next time, geek out and game on.